Brazil's president is visiting Israel with promises of a new era of friendship between the two countries. But the far-right leader, Jair Bolsonaro, is often described as controversial, dividing the Jewish community in Brazil. But what about the Brazilians in Israel? To know more, I went to the Brazilian Cultural Center in Tel Aviv. Here in Israel, the support for Bolsonaro is much more pronounced because Brazilians here have always dreamt of the two countries getting closer. Even in Brazil, uh, the Jewish community have different views about politics. And here in Israel, the same. But here, until now, we didn't feel the the great divisions that we're feeling in Brazil. According to Beit Brazil, the organization helping Brazilians in Israel, the past few years has seen an exodus of Brazilian Jews to Israel like never before. Traditionally, we have something like 200 people from Brazil coming to Israel to live in Israel. That's the historical mark. But in the, let's say, last four years, five years, this mark uh, passed to almost a 1,000 Brazilians per year. Bolsonaro has been criticized for his outspoken praise of Brazil's former military dictatorship and for controversial comments about women, race and human rights. But in Israel, his supporters see it differently. The, the Brazilians that came here, they were fed up with the situation in Brazil. So they wanted a change. They wanted a, a, a basic, fundamental change in the government there. Um, and I think Bolsonaro answered this call. Even so, Beit Brazil expects the rise in Brazilians moving to Israel to continue. I see a lot of Brazilians coming, also running away from, from the lack of security in Brazil, and also because the previous generations were here and, and they succeeded. The Cultural Center preparing for more Brazilian-Israeli events and bigger audiences.